Laura and Steve, as you can see, there aren't many sidewalks here near the high school. It's one of the many reasons why drivers are being asked to slow down. It's now that time of the year when drivers in every community are being asked to pay close attention to these signs. In Ash Grove, police are warning drivers that many school zone speed limits have been adjusted around town. In Aurora, the hope is a new school zone speed limit will help keep students, especially those who walk to school, safer. Freshmen, sophomore usually can't drive, and so that leaves your juniors and seniors. But, um, but for the most part, with as many residents as close to that facility, then they have that opportunity to walk. And some of them would rather do that, especially on nice days, than, than get on the bus and travel. And we also have cross country going through there, kids running, so make sure that everybody's alert and safe. But actually folks were pretty, pretty good. The Aurora Police Chief, Wes Coatney, says people speeding near the high school is an issue he's been watching. Prospect happens to be hilly, and so um, high speed could be deadly there uh, as you approach the school from either direction. While there hasn't been any recent accidents, Coatney hopes to prevent that. He says law enforcement will be there as much as possible to enforce the new rules and crack down on speeders. And there are people that will disregard um, those speed limit signs and um, may force us into a situation where we have to enforce that speed zone. Around the time school starts and then around the time school ends, we'll have a law enforcement just like this morning. Uh, we had law enforcement there on prospect uh, using radar detection, radar speed uh, enforcement. It also helps us get our buses out. You know, when you've got 250 students that are trying to exit a building and buses at the same time, then it makes it difficult sometimes, so the slower speed will help. The chief tells me they'll soon be putting in some flashing signs to help get the attention of drivers here in the area. Reporting in Aurora, Ashley Eddy, Ozarks First.